If you've ever asked yourself, can a vegan or a plant-based diet change my period or improve my period in any way? This is the video for you. Now there is some evidence that suggests that vegan diets can be beneficial for some people's menstrual cycle. But let me tell you from the onset, I am a plant-based eater. I am vegan. My shirt even says plants are cool. If that doesn't tell you I'm vegan, then I don't know what will. I've seen many positive changes to my period since I started eating a fully plant-based diet. However, that's not what this video is about at all. This is not anecdotal evidence. I'm gonna share real concrete things that the scientists are saying. However, if you would like me to create a video about my personal experience, because I think those are fun, so you can see exactly what I did, what I eat, and how it changed my period, I'm open to do that as well. So let me know in the comments if you would like to see that. So I share that information because I want you to know that there is going to be some inherent bias. Like there is in just about every video you watch. Someone has their own feelings, thoughts, and opinions about it. However, in this video, I'm going to try to be as neutral as possible when it comes to this topic. And I'm going to be doing that by referencing references. So let's get into how a vegan diet can potentially assist your period. So one of the ways a vegan diet can potentially assist your menstrual health is because animal products tend to be inflammatory and a lot of plant foods, whole food plant-based items like your fruits, your vegetables, and even your grains, if you don't have celiac disease, can be anti-inflammatory. They have a lot of anti-inflammatory properties. And reducing inflammation in the body can help reduce menstrual pain and other menstrual symptoms. Now I have to share that there's minimal evidence to show that plant-based diets improve your premenstrual symptoms. However, that's because little research has been done. Not that it has been done and came back to the contrary. Now most studies that have been done to date are observational, which means you can't establish a cause and effect relationship. However, there are some studies worth mentioning. One in particular we're going to discuss. One study found that following a low-fat vegan diet for just two cycles significantly reduced premenstrual pain, duration, and intensity. That is possibly due to the high fiber intake. Just two cycles. That's wild. And I'm going to put the reference here on the screen, and I'm also going to put it below in the description, because if you're like me, you like to know where this stuff comes from. Also, Texas Healthcare Obstetrics and Gynecology shared on the website that a high fiber diet is not just beneficial for digestion, but it can help ease period pains. Combined with a low fat diet, high fiber intake can help lower estrogen levels. Once estrogen and progesterone have been used by the reproductive system, the process through the liver and pass through the intestines. This said, I have to add a slight caveat here. Because plant-based foods are super high in fiber, they are nutritionally dense, which means that you're going to get fuller quicker as you're eating, which isn't necessarily a bad thing. However, you want to make sure you're meeting your minimum daily caloric requirement, whatever that is for you, because you don't want to be under eating and starving yourself. And someone may mention, but well, what about iron? Or what about protein? You can get plenty of both on a vegan diet. However, it's important to note that iron deficiency affects women whether they're vegan or not, especially if they have a heavy flow. However, there are some great sources of iron from a plant-based diet, and I want to share them with you. Dark leafy greens like kale and spinach, things like beans and legumes, and this includes kidney beans, navy beans, black beans, I mean, the list can go on. Lentils and chickpeas, tofu, nuts and seeds, and even iron-fortified cereals. And iron can be more easily absorbed in greens by putting a little squeeze of lemon or lime on it, and the citrus actually helps your body to better absorb the iron. Simple fix. And a multivitamin with iron can assist in this case as well, not just vegans, but women who eat meat as well. But don't listen to me. Go ask your doctor. I am your doctor. Now, there are so many different topics on this spectrum that I can talk about, but let me know if this is of interest to you. If so, I will dive into this and we can make it a whole series and include a whole bunch of videos specifically about vegan diets getting your protein, getting your iron, and how it improves and impacts your period as well. If that's something you're going to be interested in, let me know in the comments and I'll create it for you. We're besties after all. If you enjoyed this video, I'd suggest you watch this one next.